I kind of sort of just stumbled into this team comp, but it actually works really well. We were absolutely getting crushed and all of a sudden it just kind of fit together and we got seagulls and we got peanuts and it just worked. I don't know what else to say. Try it out if you have a chance. It's a lot of fun. It feels a little cheesy and it doesn't work against Hatsworm, but I don't think anything does. See what you think. Let me know. Should be a fun one. Let's jump right in. Hmm, all right, start me here. Frog just doesn't really feel like it does much. Maybe we don't. Maybe we don't frog here. You can go some double strawberry action. <laughs> oh my god. The tennis ball wreaks havoc this week. All right, we go here. Definitely want to get the ferret out for our gecko. Obviously a running balloon, you know how it is. Ooh, they are also running balloon. Beautiful. B E A beautiful. The new strawberry feels really good. I think it's a fantastic change. It actually feels like it has its own character, you know. It's got life to it now. Um Mandrill, sure. I think we can mine here. I don't mind the balloon hitting the mandrill. I'd rather get rid of the gecko if we're getting rid of anybody. Kangaroo. Maybe. Probably not, though. Ooh. We do get enough to take him out, and we draw. We'll take it. It's always nice not losing on tier 3. Or turn 3, I should say. I don't know why, I feel like I always lose on turn 3. <laughs> it just happens, I don't know what it is. Here to the gecko, give me a tree. Uh, maybe we should have gone ferret actually. Instead of a tree. Potentially, not sure. Then we could get the mandrill trigger in battle. Not that it matters, I guess. It actually would have, we would have won I think. But now we get a tier 4? Hmm, Seagull's interesting. I guess Whale could also be interesting if we can get... if we can get a Flying Squirrel going. Maybe we try it. Hold me. Found him. Okay. The Whale's gonna get buffs. Probably get rid of you, right? That's just like probably the correct play. Um, go here. Well, I think we'll probably end up leveling the mandrill anyways, but in case we don't, I'd rather get a higher tier homie, but we'll see. Brother, you forgot the most important part of the salad. You forgot the, the, the strawberry. Um, yeah, let's, let's just level him. Falcon seems pretty good. Better than the tree, I'd reckon, yeah, most likely. Go here. Oh, dude, Baboon is very tempting. I'd like to get another Ferret and then a Flying Squirrel. I think 2-2 two, two every other turn is obviously a lot better than, <laughs> than the 2-1, the one, or the 1-1. One, one. Ooh, Pegasus with the homie? That's pretty good. Not gonna matter, but... We get the draw. Okay. But I guess the baboon... Here's the issue. Whale's eating you while you're getting buffed from this, so that... Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Also, I want the baboon scaling on the falcon. Oh, <laughs> I think he's gonna be gone. Um, we can throw you in. There's a lot of seagulls. Seagulls tempting, for sure. I mean, when given this many seagulls, I feel like you kind of gotta play it, right? Looking good. Somehow our falcon survived. 
That was incredibly lucky. I do not think we should have won that one. Not in the slightest. So I guess we get rid of Ferret here? Unless Baboon, maybe. I'd still like to get the Ferret toy, just for the record. If that could happen, that'd be kind of cool. Still nothing. That's, that's pretty good. I'm holding on to a dream. Getting the ferret toy with the flying squirrel. Both level 2. Not sure it's going to work though. We got the early rhino. Lucky. Early rhino's so strong. Alright, starting with the level here. What do we get? Velociraptor or walrus? Oh man. Alright, well we gotta ditch this idea. I think we go... We grab you and then throw in a walrus here. You know, just something like that. At least it's some sort of held food. Not a terrible perk. Not who we wanted to hit on that one, <laughs> that's for sure. Okay. You know what? Flying Squirrel Dream is dead. Let's throw a whale in here. Here we got Seagull. Level into Highland Cow? Maybe? We could do Highland Cow. I mean, Falcon with the Walrus makes sense. Mandrill, unfortunately, we've been buffing this entire time, but he's not gonna do a whole lot anymore. He could work if we get a mongoose, I guess. We don't have the flying squirrel, it would just be in battle. Let's let's cut our losses here. Grab a Highland cow. Just run it like this, you know. I think this is the the correct play, we'll say. Perfect. Ouch. Dude, Chili OP though, what the heck? Chili's so strong. Okay, so now we wanna go mushroom on you. Right, hold on, let me, let me make sure I have this straight. If we get a mushroom on the seagull, no, actually, we don't want that. We want mushroom on you. And then we need to find another walrus and we need to pill him. And that's going to be our play. Get rid of the falcon. Grab a turkey. Kind of a weird team, admittedly. Do we get rid of the highland cow too? Maybe. Thurbris is probably pretty good. There he is. Okay. It's coming along. Coming along nicely. Okay, I like where the, the idea is. We just need to execute. We go here. Go here. Gotta find a pill. That's our primary issue right now. There are no pills to be found. Perfect. It's kind of working a little bit. Maybe if you squint. Um, so we go here. Again, we're kind of looking for a pill right now. Um, maybe ignore the mongoose for a second. Let's go Cerberus level 2. And then ignore the chocolate for a second, because these guys are kind of, they're already level 2. Let's try to find this pill. It's got to be somewhere, right? 
Surely we can find a pill somewhere. Everyone's running peanut strats. Not like we are. <laughs> Feels a little weird, but it does work. Without a doubt, it most certainly works. Come on. Dang, we're just not finding any, any pills today. Maybe we should have just gone for the seagull here. Oh. That's fine. <laughs> That'll work. Alright. Keep it going. Try to find a seagull, I suppose. This is going to be our next play. That counts. Um, I guess we just go here. Try to get it to the point where we don't need these little gingerbread homies. And then we can pill the walrus freely. Solid peanuts. <laughs> This feels like it's working better than it should. Okay, here. Here, here. Because we do have to be very careful. If we don't hit the seagull on the initial walrus, we're kind of kind in trouble a little bit. Yeah, like there, he's not going to get the seagull. And we're going to get one less peanut trigger. Which obviously is not what we want. Peanuts are kind of OP, so <laughs> it doesn't turn out to really matter. Are we really going to reverse sweep this? This feels a little gross. Um, let's go... Here. Man, Wait, there are pills in this pack, right? Yeah, we got sleeping pills. We're just not finding any. Looking good. Sometimes you just gotta fight fire with fire, you know? There's so many peanuts, don't even bother scaling. <laughs> you just... You just bam peanut homies and it just works, you know? It just works. I think we go here. We're not, we might not get the turkey. Whatever. Dude, that's unfortunate. That is deeply unfortunate. That was the one time we had to get the, the seagull trigger, and we missed it. So it, this is a good point. Um, we still lose to Tatzelworm. <laughs> Pretty readily. Though, I, I mean, Tatzelworm kills everybody. If you had a scaling team, you lose against that too. Level 3 Stork with level 3 Tatzelworm with a level 3 Tiger. Yeah, I mean, you're not going to win that one. <laughs> Me a couple homies here. Start with the three one and we'll set up the ferret here. Gnarly baguettes. That's me. Okay, I forgot the strawberries. We got all the kiwis but no strawberries to, to boot. Okay, give me a balloon, give me a level on you. Sure. I think we can work around this. Oh, baby. That just works. That just gets us there. I love it. Alright, so we go here, we go here. That's a bit of a shame. We should have a whole bunch of one and a halves right now. Grab a stilt, call it a day. Yeah, tennis ball, not gonna cut it for you there, brother. Oh, we almost got it. We're close. Alright, let's just get a whole team of one and a halfs and then we'll lose. That's our plan. <laughs> Chipmunk, let's get rid of you. I don't really care about him. 
chipmunk feels like it could be all right. Maybe I'm missing some like good combo with them. It's just like, it's not very exciting, you know? You don't get up out of bed for the chipmunk. Here we go here. Let's ditch you. And then let's ditch you. Hmm. Let's go Falcon. Falcon's just fun. I like the Falcon. We could get a level on the stilt here. If we wanted to go that route, but yeah, who cares? Okay, koala's doing work. Kind of. A little bit. It countered our falcon for what that's worth. So the baboon buffing the griffin for obvious reasons does not matter a whole lot. Get you some attack going. Okay, nothing, nothing. Nothing at all. Alright, I was gonna sell the marmoset for the squirrel and recoup this balloon. But since we have the marmoset here, we can just level up next turn. I'm not really tied to the balloon, you know. We don't need the balloon. Good hits. Well, imagine if we had strawberry though. <laughs> We'd be cooking right now. Okay, and then the dog gets us there. Beautiful. Alright, what do we get? Tier 5. Husky? Um, it's unfortunate that we have the croissant now. <laughs> I didn't really think that far ahead. Let's throw in the husky here. You don't need to hold on to the flying squirrel. Um, uh, maybe? I mean, straight up, just do this, right? Get the scaling going here. Getting there. Our scaling is starting to come through. Um, let's see, who do we want to pill for a banana? Maybe we don't want a banana. We're trying to buff the falcon, but he can't be up front, right? Um, parrot would be pretty good. Throw behind the falcon. Sure. Good enough, I would say. Um, seagull's kind of interesting. You go falcon with some peanuts and get seagull with some peanuts. <laughs> There's something there. Um, do we get rid of the gecko? That's the question. Probably. Now's the time to do it. He is an 810 though. That would kind of nuke our team a little bit. But hey, let's give it a shot. Okay. That's unfortunate. Man, these rhinos though, go hard. Ooh, husky, sure, sure. Don't mind if I do. Another husky, don't mind if I do. Into a parrot. And we probably go Wildebeest if we can find a good island cow. But for now, I think this is just solid. Sure, we'll take it. Kind of a scuffed win on that one, but <laughs> don't mind if I do. Alright, Walrus is good. Who do we get rid of, though? <laughs> the antelope is pretty strong. That's the tough part. 
I'd like to go Cerberus Walrus. But the Falcon with the Seagull. So the Cerberus would play the same same position, I guess, as the Falcon. Um, Falcon just has higher end potential if it kills enough. But maybe we don't want that unknown, right? And we could even put a parrot behind him. Then where does the walrus go? What if the seagull? No, we want the seagull though. <laughs> this is so tough. Eventually we get rid of the husky, but I don't think we do it just yet. Let's wait a second. Let these guys scale up a little more with the husky. I'm just a little nervous to full send the pivot, you know? Take it. I mean, with peanuts, the pivot shouldn't require a whole lot of stats, in theory. <laughs> That's a that's a big should not. If we're doing the walrus thing, we're gonna try to pill him, which I believe we are. The husky's not gonna work. So let's do it like this while we get three free eight gold here. This is the natural pivot, even though I'm afraid to do it. This is the time to do it. Okay. Good, we're looking for the walrus. Keep these two homies. So if we can hit the seagull, that would be huge. We did not hit the seagull. I think we're still okay though, so that's good. Staying at two hearts, love to see it. That's huge. Give me a level. Don't want those. Go here. Maybe we go parrot here, just as a redundancy. Right, so the only way that we don't get any peanuts on these on the Cerberus summons is if we hit exactly these two. And then we'd still get to use two triggers. We wouldn't get three potentially, but we wouldn't either with the seagull. So I think this is probably the play. Hold on to the parrot. See, there you go. Unfortunately, their team is just really big because they have a husky, but I like where we're at. Give you a gingerbread man. Hold here. Um, we don't want the pill yet. We need to get a mushroom on you. That's step one. Beautiful. Exactly how I chalked it up in my head. <laughs> Level you. We'll hold off on the Cerberus here for a second, see if we can get a mushroom. Don't need it. Ah, oh, not finding any mushrooms here. It's a bummer. <laughs> yep. That's, that'll do it. <laughs> if anything, I see this as a well-balanced weekly. Because this hard counters any of the heavy scaling teams. But the Rhino Tiger and the Tatsil Worm hard counters this team. And then, well, I guess nobody really hard counters Tatsil Worm. But <laughs> in theory, um, with some scaling, this could take on a rhino. But yeah, Tatsil Worm. Aside from another Tatsil Worm, I guess there's no counter. So that's the only caveat there. 